And the reason we're protecting the wolf is that it's time for mankind to understand that they're not the only sacred what? beings on earth. We have to bring the wolf and the buffalo back. What they're doing to the wolf is breaking federal law and Indian nation treaty law. We got to stop what we're doing and think about what we're doing. We could all live together. If these people that are killing the wolf are eating it, they need it to survive, we'll let them kill it. If they're not eating it, they gotta stop. My friend, John Tester, the US Senator, who passed the rider in the U.S. Senate two years ago to open up the wolf hunt for America, violated spiritual law, lied to the Indian people of Montana that he would not do sneaky riders into congressional bills to, to pass law. First thing he did was pass this sneaky law to open up the endangered law to kill the wolf here in Montana, Wyoming, and Idaho. This man doesn't care for the Indians. He just wants a vote. He doesn't care for the public. He just wants a vote. But I will continue to love him and pray for him so he could come someday and apologize to me for killing my sacred animal, my sacred brother, my protector, Magui, John Tester, my brother, the Magui, is waiting for you to come to your senses. Waiting for the public of America to come and do the right thing. So I'm going to sing this song for the people who love the wolf. are doing is a thousand percent correct. It may not be right, but it is correct. The reason it's correct is because it's spiritual. This is so spiritual of the work we're doing to protect these sacred animals that nothing on earth compares to it. 